Wait, I'm broke. You're so broke that we had to change what you're looking at. What? You really gave, you really sent your realtor for a loop this week. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I had, to, I had a, I'm so broke, I had a long, drawn out discussion with my realtor. Yeah. Changing targets. The numbers aren't adding up. What you're asking <laughs> for and what you're getting approved for are two completely different things. <laughs> it's like just a homeless guy with a realtor. <laughs> my, my realtor's really not feeling it right now because I'm. It has to happen right now. The amount of realtors. My realtor's frustrated with me. Yeah. This is going on and it's, uh, they're getting really frustrated because I was at the office today mm -hmm. having a coffee with just, just a team of realtors mm -hmm. and the Hyde project is going sideways. <laughs> they're like, guys, what's going on with the Hyde project? The <laughs> listings, where are they at? And, um, uh, it's, uh, it's tough to deal with. Mm -hmm. And, um. You said you wanted to live in, you said you wanted Baltimore, a million plus. No, you said you want, no, you said you said you don't want to stay in Rhode Island. <laughs> you said that I only know how to talk about Rhode Island houses. I only, I only want to look at million, 1.5 million plus homes in North Smithfield, Cranston, Warwick, Pawtucket. Yep. You, you Lincoln. found, you found, you wanted that area. Lincoln, you wanted horse, horse property. Now the question is, did you find me something? Yeah, I think I did. Okay. I have to just check that out. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I think that I came together with a... We put some minds together. How's the Hyde Project progressing? Old sales, silver. Let's check, let's check this. Because um, we came together with a team. I don't remember. I just want to make sure. Okay. This is a nice house. Should I brought, I brought you a nice versus a bad this week. Mm -hmm. Do you want to do the nice one first or the bad we'll one? We'll go with the nice one first. All right. We'll go with the nice one. This is that nice as country estate highlands. Some old money. You said you wanted some old world charm with some new new world amenities, and we went with a center fireplace, uh, colonial salt box colonial. Mm -hmm. I don't know what they call that, but but uh, this is this is eight eight hundred and sixty four thousand. Oh, there's the trampoline. Yep, the trampoline on the roof. Mm -hmm. A tarp over the arbor. I think a second floor arbor. Mm -hmm. Maybe no, that's a first floor covered uh, outdoor eating area mm -hmm. with uh, built in gardens. Uh, white PVC fence, bad. A couple of natural stone walls, all new windows. Uh, Lap Street barn siding, two decent doors with a cupola, which those those are like fourth that that thing on That's top cool. of the garage. Yeah, like those that. are like forty five hundred bucks, six grand sometimes. Mm. Um, they engineered the garage well. That is a that, that's an outdoor seating area with a Boston City Hall paver, a, a nice red brick, which is an old world brick, which is classic. It means they have taste. Mm. Probably some moss growing in there. It's half indoor, half outdoor. Um, so that's so you can get out of the bugs. Oh, you can smoke up in there. Mm -hmm. So you don't have to get eaten alive by mosquitoes. Because mm -hmm. you said your big concern was, I hate getting eaten alive by fucking mosquitoes. Well, actually, you might have misread that. Mosquitoes don't touch me for some reason. Really? Yeah. I haven't been bitten up by a mosquito in like fucking 15 years. That's spooky. What's that's, up with that? That's shrouded in mystery. And the thing is, when I look in the mirror, my reflection... It's black and white. Not there? It's black and uh -oh. white. Did you tell the mortgage broker that? Not yet. I didn't want to have anything negative that affects my rate. I don't have to let you guys know that I don't care about mosquitoes, right? <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't make a difference, does it, Adam? <laughs> uh, no, tastefully modded kitchen. That's probably a shitty island. Uh... They did it well. I, I don't think so. This is nice. They did a Corian top with a weird industrial restoration hardware light, and then that like trendy Spanish tile. But they did put a pot filler in, and that's a Wolf range. That's about six grand. Mm -hmm. That hood's probably twenty five hundred. It is a little ill fitting, but whatever. It's a slide out second dishwasher or a plate warmer. Mm -hmm. It's probably a dishwasher. And then uh, it's not bad. The problem is with these colonials, they have small rooms. You're a big guy. I think you're gonna bump your head on the lights, and when you're when you're cooking a nice. That's you, okay. I like to hunch over. Okay, good. This isn't the two million dollar one. This is eight sixty four. The next okay. one I'm gonna show you is two million. Okay, so nicer. Uh, you you tell me. So this is you gotta walk through seventeen hundreds fireplace. Those, that room's smaller than you think. Like your feet, yeah, like you yeah. would look like a giant in that picture if you mm -hmm. sat on that chair. If you let's just say you took your pants off during the showing, and you decided to show the realtor that you can shit your pants in the realtor, mm -hmm. and then the, in the recliner. Mm -hmm. I can sit in this recliner, and take my pants off, and shit comfortably. Watch. Mm -hmm. Here, I'll lay down. I'll lay uh, ass up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
I'm Kevin Spacey. <laughs> you lay the recliner flat even though it doesn't. You just like you you <laughs> yeah. shove it, you crank it back. See, I told I thought I told you. I told I was so sick of arguing about this. I told you I could do it. <laughs> Oh, you're in the driveway. Like, you can't do it. I was like, oh, watch. Watch me. <laughs> um, Sometimes you have to get your back <laughs> up. Sometimes. Sometimes you want. You want the boy to rub a feather on your head. <laughs> I brought you a few feathers, Romeo. <laughs> My name's Beth. <laughs> Uh-oh, that's going to be a problem. Where's Romeo? Oh, we're playing tag. <laughs> no one's playing tag with him. He's just fucking poking. Anyway, pretty, pretty good back. People love that, by the way. Tag, poking and No, tag. you're Kevin Spacey impression. Oh, oh God. Yeah, yeah. People were hitting me up about it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck. I never thought, well, it's just, you just listen to him leave you voicemails for long enough and for so many years, mm. you start to know what the guy sounds like. Mm -hmm. Nick, pick up. <laughs> I want to go antiquing. <laughs> I want to buy a vase that could fit. Never mind. I'll find it. I'll let you know when I find it. Where'd you put the vase that you bought, Kevin? Guess. <laughs> oh my God, man. Oh, he's derailing us from your 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 most important buy. I've been waiting my whole life to finally closet sell you a good. house. Wait, is this the this is the the one we're? This is actually the good. Yeah, this is the closet. Look at these people are just normal people. He's got his twelve pairs of New Balances, his Merrells. Mm -hmm. Oh look, you got Sambas. This is me. Sambas. Mm. This guy's me. There you go. He's got the same bedroom set, the home mm -hmm. pillow that you put in, mm -hmm. the Ashley <clears throat> underbed storage furniture. The grayed out. I mean, these people love Dave Matthews Band, and um, I hope they're like, I hope they're alcoholics. To be honest with you, I hope like the good side of this is they have like a nice alcohol problem in a good way. And I don't mean that. Mm. Pine floors, which is the cheap way out. Those are heart pine floors, not good. And uh, a mural painted on the wall, which is uh, honestly that's a red flag. <laughs> get that off there. <laughs> like I like Jake will tell me like get uh, change that. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, you have to have like objective. Think like, hey guys, uh, paint over that. Like Jake will grab by the back of the neck. Yeah, yeah, go get the paint. Do you, I saw some paint in the garage. Uh, is it white? Yeah, we'll just go right over that. <laughs> yeah, this stuff. This is like hokey shit. No one like this is really bringing you down. This is for like a uh, like a house that's three hundred grand less than your house. You're fucking yourself right now. This is like bringing a portion with like flames on it. <laughs> yeah, your house with like a like a meadow scene. Mm -hmm. I think, I think it's supposed to be like Chinese watercolor. It, it does. Stuff. It looks. I'm like. It, it, it must be. That's a very strange looking. Yeah. Thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I pay you a country meadow. <laughs> <laughs> like pushy Chinese restaurant guy that paints murals. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like the meadow of from your memories. <laughs> uh, <Nebra> apple, <laughs> Nebraska. <laughs> apple blossom here, but it's it's not bad. Uh, mm -hmm. So it's a it's a big old colonial. It's a dusty, but the the outside's pretty nice. It's got outbuildings. Mm -hmm. Um. There's probably like 96 bedrooms in this thing where you can just raise a litter of kids that all play lacrosse. Mechanical room is all sealed like that. That's a that's probably like a four four thousand uh, dollar basement floor job cleaning up all the mechanical systems. The, all the zone valves are in a, a nice line right there. Mm -hmm. The water heaters of decent quality, and uh, you got a uh, water softener. But it's neat. It's just a nice yeah, neat yeah. house, clean. The joists like oh the house is new. Oh I didn't know that. So those joists are uh, those new beams that you make out of two by four and plywood. They're just, I don't know what the fuck they call them, but so the house is probably built in like old four. Anyway, that's a, a cool barn. You can put all your hot rods in. You can put your thirty two T bucket, mm -hmm. your fifty five Bel Air. Mm -hmm. uh, if you go on that right there, you you went into a wood shop, but you could you could have fifteen Kawasaki motor. You could have a lineage of Kawasaki motorcycles in here, Sam. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You could do you could have a dirt track here. Mm -hmm. You could do RC car racing, mm. chicken coop. Mm -hmm. Put Grimes in there. <laughs> does this house come with an anorexic cutter girl? Uh, it does. Okay. Has two. The, the, <laughs> it has two. They call them the, themselves the Olsen twins. <laughs> <laughs> they chill for cigarettes. <laughs> you girls want to chill? They're like, uh huh. And they're like, what do you want? Cigarettes. I'm like, cool. You're nice. It was a it was a normal number. It went pending right away. Mm -hmm. That was a pretty good version. Now this is the retard next door to him. 
this kid, that, now that guy was like a normal guy who got good grades in school, and then this is the bully who, who, uh, who was an idiot. <laughs> this is, uh... Those, those lawn chairs look nice. That was a good idea. <laughs> Just a couple of Adirondacks out there in the grass. Not, the grass won't get br- yellow underneath it at all. You'll probably move them every time you cut the grass, so you'll like that. Um, nice idiotic planting with no uh, consideration. <coughs> now, this house is $2 million mm-hmm. uh, down the street. Mm-hmm. So you just saw one that was eight sixty four. The house is currently pending. This one's came out. This is, but you wanted that price tag. You said, Nick, I want brassy, two million, baby. I want to feel like I'm doing something. Yeah, this not, is not wasting my time, wasting my money. And I'm with you. A house like this, you can feel like a baseball player. <laughs> a high school baseball player. No, a college baseball. College player. baseball player. You want to feel like a college baseball player? Paw Tucket, Paw Sox. Yep. Okay. Two seasons with the Paw Sox baseball player. Okay. And you found a really cute college this nice. soccer. This has got a nice thick backyard. Looks like the backside of a housing project. <laughs> uh, good size windows because the guy spent the money. I wish the windows were a little smaller. I'll be honest with you. I, you know what? I, I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> How many? Give me. Um. Oh, I need windows. You're right. This house is going to need windows. <laughs> Fuck it. Give me 30 of them. Oh my That's god. how we order windows. Give me 30 of them. Oh my god, man. And it's if you look at them, they are. Like that that third window right there, you can bond three piece of shit windows together with a clip. Mm-hmm. So if you bought, like, literally the guy bought the same size window. Oh man. And then you can use this, like, clip and you can make it look like a bay window, like that fucking retard with the, with the, the half moon on top of it. The, Holy shit. So a total, literally, he bought bulk. It was a one, two, three, four, six, five. I don't know. It's probably like 35, 40 windows, and they're probably like 100 bucks a piece. So it's like four grand for windows. Okay, next item, line item. That's so funny, man. We're selling this thing for big money. I need the cheapest ones you can get. <laughs> Let me do the least amount. Oh, is that a power line on the side of you? Great. <laughs> I love that. This is like this is like diamond, though. Well, you got a power line on the side of you, and you know what? <laughs> And here's what people who live next to power lines always say about power lines. It's like free land. You get to like kind of use it. It's like your own free land. That's how they justify having, oh you know, brain god. tumors. Oh my god. That's how they justify, you know, setting up their kids 5K. But it's nice that it even sticks out from the, the drone shots that we're just doing on this property. Mercilessly drone shotting the, the fucking uh, hide the power line, dude. Oh, they cut it like it's their own. Oh no. Oh my gosh. They fertilize it or something. Like they cut it. Don't tell me they cut it. Do they cut it? They do. So it can be like a part of their land. That's so fucking gay. Oh, that's so trashy. Anyway. Oh man. Uh, also, so when you separate two grades like that, mm-hmm. see how it comes down? Uh huh. So water would pool up against the house, right? Mm-hmm. That crushed stone valley is a. Uh, there's a pipe underneath there. There's like a, uh, a trench that starts at the top that collects water from the driveway because it leaks towards the house because they didn't feel like filling. They didn't want to pick up the whole house. Mm-hmm. In order to do that, they would have had to bring in probably f- like 250 truckloads of fill to pick the the, the level up mm-hmm. to put the ho- house. So instead of doing that, they'll just catch the water at the top and put a big giant drain. Mm-hmm. And then instead of dressing it up, hiding it in any way, shape, or form, they'll just do a shitty rock wall with a... Uh, Walker's Low Cat Mint on top of it, which is a $7 plant. But uh, yeah, well, let's, let's keep cruising on this sweet piece. Let's get to this fucking interior <laughs> finishes. These gorgeous interior <laughs> finishes. Some, I know, I know you love the door. <clears throat> that door was called Celebration. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Nick. That was the Pella Celebration Series door oh. with a double side light, and you wanted that. You were like, Nick, I need the fucking Celebration light! And you were swearing at him. You were swearing at me. You threw hot sauce at my wife. <laughs> Why is he fucking with me, Jess? No, no, he's fucking with me about the Celebration Series doors. <laughs> and in the foyer, so the door opens up, and you got a nice four-inch space behind the, uh, the door. It was really good engineering on this point. Oh, they always fuck that up. When you oh, there's a pool table in the background there, Sam. Oh, cool. They did, they did a, another great tile choice here with the twelve by twelve gray. Uh, cheapest well, what I would like world. is I would like the rolling office chairs mm. by the pool table. I think that would feel cozy. Yeah, like John Goodman. Yeah, <laughs> like John Goodman's over your house. Great, that's a great. Co- nothing better than a couch with speakers. <laughs> 
You did it, dude. <laughs> my couch has Wi-Fi. It's got speakers. <laughs> it's got a cooler in it. It's got it. He's got a nice circle rug. Nice job lot, high pile circle rug, and um, holy fuck! I love the Tiffany knockoff lamp. That's really great. The pedestal shows they have class. Mm -hmm. Um, this oh, is so fucked up looking. Like the fur pillows. God, this fucking guy. Something. This guy's house looks like my fucking. I can't. Looks like my dad's house. <laughs> 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 like that's like a like a pretty ladies like she, pretty lady somewhere in the house. Look at this place. Oh, God, this like Tuscan fucking uh, night two thousand four. The little speakers around the TV. That's, that's all wireless. That's so ugly. And then the art. God damn. The good art. They probably got that. That's. <clears throat> I don't know. I probably got it at fucking Home Goods or something. Nice cherry wood kitchen cabinets. That's always good. Wow. Uh, anytime you see 12 by 12 flooring, you just know that the guy just took every cheap fucking route ever. It's just a dead tell. Mm -hmm. It's like, just what else, what else did you fucking cheap out on, you fucking prick? No uh, back, no back plate on the islands, mm -hmm. so you can buy a cherry wood OG back plate, but they weren't doing that. And a nice breakfast bar that no one uses anymore. And, uh, but it looks like the Sopranos house, to be honest with you. Do, do, no. It'd be a good house to walk around in wet pool shoes in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a good selling point. Yeah. It's, yeah. If you own this house, you'd want you'd want to walk around sopping wet in uh, swim trunks and pool <laughs> shoes all the time, squeaking everywhere you go. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Always in a bathing suit, wishy washy squeaking sounds. What a strange looking, yeah, building. Nice, <clears throat> ch nice Chippendale uh, dining room set that they inherited from their parents. A jug full of corks to show how much wine they drink. Hey, that's good. Wow. A vino, a horse chandelier above it for its because it's classy. No rug underneath the dining room table. That's a Duncan Fife table. That's a piece of shit. It's worthless. I wouldn't buy it for five dollars. Um, I wouldn't buy those chairs for twenty bucks. Um, <laughs> literally, not a joke. <laughs> and then the whatever the keep scrolling, keep, on, keep on rolling. Uh, nice nothing bathroom. Who cares? <laughs> like an eighty-three dollars worth of Home Depot clip, <laughs> clipped onto it. Thank you. Uh, I did. I did my bathroom for eighty-three. Yeah, I got eighty-three. I got the toilet rack. Okay, do guess how much toilet rack. Toilet paper holder, above light, vanity, which is uh, has a fold out mirror on it. That's a uh, that's a vanity mirror. Chrome light, towel rack, toilet paper holder rack. Guess how much? I don't know, thousands. Eighty three bucks. <laughs> Who's a fucking man? <laughs> Who's a fucking man? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Place looks like fucking snots, dude. <laughs> nice. That's nice. After living near the power lines, this child died. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's fucking bleak, huh? Got this fucking house on from real fun to real sad real quick. Mm -hmm. uh, let me take you to the master bath. More little, more sofa couches. Oh, there's a phone there. An old-timey phone. And a full-length mirror. Oh. It's like a lawyer divorcee. It's got to be a lawyer. It's a sad person who lives here. It's a lonely existence. There's no warmth. Oh, there you go. The master suite. Wow. Uh, is that a beverage fridge? Which is a nice touch. That's a nice touch. I actually like beverage fridges mm -hmm. and inside bathrooms. A whore's bathtub. Who's taking fucking baths? Here's my argument about that. My wife was fighting with... We had like a fucking fight one time about bathtubs. Mm -hmm. And I was like, look, I'm not putting... A, like my upstairs just doesn't augment. She wanted like... Every, every girl wants this bathtub. Mm -hmm. I go... You're gonna have to re-engine, like you have to pop the roof up. I'd have to do some fucked up line. It would it would interrupt the exterior of the house because mm. for a fucking bathtub, how many times are you gonna use it? I was like, this this will cost like uh like nine grand mm. for like the tub you want with the cool setting below it with the fucking not that piece of shit, you know, like mm. the the full marble one, the one you want in mm -hmm. the window. Which what kind of fucking voyeur freak sex show shit? Like who wants like are women like? Just like, ooh. <laughs> yeah. Like in their head? Yeah. Like every, like, you have to. Because mm -hmm. the women put their foot down on bathtubs a lot. Mm -hmm. I've heard it like, oh, we're getting a bathtub. Like, what are you going to do? You're going to fucking finger yourself in it? Because it's a tall order. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? It's very like, no, no, no. I want, and like, you think about what they're doing. Like, ah, oh, soak in a tub. Mm -hmm. It's half the cost of a fucking pool, dude. Mm-hmm. Like no bathtub privacy, me mm -hmm. spa, mm -hmm. you know the spa feel, mm -hmm. right? Not like it's like a office space. The movie, the bathroom. 
<laughs> the spa, the bathroom. <laughs> It's fucking brutal. Oh my god! I like the plumbing just shooting right up through the floor. The twelve by twelve black marble, the obsidian black marble tile. That's literally the. That's as cheap as you can get marble wise. Mm-hmm. That's like a dollar ninety seven a foot. Marble is typically about ten fifteen bucks a foot. That that you can get for a dollar at BJ's. Mm-hmm. Your Portuguese tile guy pointed it out to you, and you liked it because it was cheap. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then, uh, fucking torture room. <laughs> You can pizza Podesta pizza. That's, a joke. Torture. That's where Podesta's art collection can go. <laughs> a nice worst balcony you can possibly build with uh, cheap fucking Home Depot railing fucking and fucking yikes. Rat ass thirty six inch balusters for a dollar. It looks like there's a door suspended on a <laughs> without oh, it a, steps down. Without a floor. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Oh like a oh that's that's why it's two million right there. <laughs> that's a that's like a McMansion move right there. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, we're going above the garage now. Mm-hmm. Level change. Mm-hmm. What's going on? It's so, like, weird shit. It's like MC yeah. Escher. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is where you walk upside down to the debt triangle. <laughs> walk down these stairs Holy to, go to the, shit, Nick. go to the suicide garage. Nick, man, you're so fucking funny. No, no, no. Yes, you are, dude. But a pool table oh, is funnier God. than I'll ever be. <laughs> A pool table in your living room. That is a single. That's a single guy's house. This is a lawyer. This has got to be a lawyer's house. Mm. That is so brassy. Like, and stupid. Mm-hmm. Although I do love pool. Damn, look at how bad that house is, bro. Your house is so <laughs> gay. Imagine being friends with this guy. Like, say like, say it's like you're like a accountant or something. Mm-hmm. And you're like, Nick, why don't you come over and like, watch football? And Well, all right. And this is like, Man, this house fucking sucks. Oh, my God. Jim, is this your house? Wow, this place fucking blows, man. God, is that a 46-inch TV in 2020? <laughs> Spectacular, custom-built. You got it. Actually, you got it, Sammy. Capital, dude. Look how every word is capitalized. Mm-hmm. That's the that's a, the product of a real mind. This is a spectacular custom build. This magnificent Center Hall Colonial is truly unique in both design and location. Newly constructed in 2006 and offering 6,500 square feet of living area with a spacious open concept. The main level is an entertainer's dream. The two-story marble foyer leads into an amazing front to back family room with game room and wet bar. Gleaming hardwoods throughout. The stunning kitchen features ch- custom cherry cabinets, pantry, granite counters, stainless appliances, and opens to the dining room and cozy living room with one of the three fireplaces. Wow. Well, uh, the huge master ensuite features double walk-in closets and master bath with bear claw tub. Mm-hmm. He called it a bear claw tub. We're going to call this guy again. Hold on. Three, <laughs> you fucking retard. <laughs> Wow. There's an attached two-car garage, a separate one-car. Wow, property is beautiful landscape. Over 2.5 acres. Now, does that include the power lines? <laughs> Do I own the power lines? <laughs> so he did a square footage play here. He probably did 6,500 times $300 a foot, and that's how he got his arri- his uh, that's how he got his price. <laughs> you can't build a house right now of this quality for $300 a foot, Sam. Mm-hmm. That's what the guy said. Mm-hmm. I went by that house that we looked at last week. I drove by it. That piece of shit with mm-hmm. the, that's a million dollars on the road. Yeah. It's, it's unbelievable. Mm-hmm. But, so do you think you want to buy it, Sam? So, well, Sam. I really liked it, but then you said all that bad stuff about it, so now I'm self-conscious. But I still want it. <laughs> it's the pool table, isn't it? You can hear <laughs> yeah. the crack of a good rack. Yeah. Yep. You know me. You can hear the hum of a good power line. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> In your nice, your uh, nice one door garage. <laughs> I'd, I'll sleep in the room closest to the power lines. <laughs> Sam, why is your head getting so big? <laughs> no, it's the size of a small trash can <laughs> on one side. <laughs> yeah, that's mm. tough, man. Um, so, yeah, we're going to have to keep looking, I think. I guess so. That's okay.